<laughs> I've been working really terrible jobs with the bowling salaries, so I've decided to sit down today and write a guff CV. And listening work experience seems like the place to start. I'll make the most of what I am, a CV work of art. <laughs> in a cake making factory, it always seemed to fall to me during breaks in moulding marzipan monkey hands to make the tea. But how can I spin that and embolden with grandeur? I know, I'll call it hydration and filtration manager. <laughs> <laughs> and I once worked in the kitchen of a local restaurant, doing nothing fancy, just washing up the pots. But how can I better frame this for the CV connoisseur? I'll say it's Senior Bacterial Eradication Officer. <laughs> 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 well, I did, honestly, you weren't proud, you? Yeah. Uh, One year when I was younger, and this is true, I did deliver the Yellow Pages, and I actually delivered the Yellow Pages to Sade, the singer's mum. Well, somebody told me it was around, so I don't know how sure. <laughs> <laughs> um, she was the nurse, in fact, in hospital. Um, one year when I was younger, I delivered the yellow pages, traipsing round for hours on end. It took me bloody ages. But how to make a potential employer look more favourably on this? I'll rename it Communication Data Dispersion Specialist. <laughs> so now I've got a CV that's much stronger than before. I've got some interviews lined up and was confident for more. I rock up in my suit and tie and get my foot right in the door, though I do fear probing questions on the jobs I've had before. Most every time I interviewed it, it'd go well at the start, but then the piercing questions came and blew my ruse apart. <laughs> <laughs> to tell the truth for once, I was close to throwing in the towel, but I had one more in the diary, so I thought, oh, what the hell. So I turn up in this office, leather chairs, oak panelled walls. Various beheaded beasts follow me with their eyeballs. There was one of those glow drink cabinets, I always liked the look of those. A powdered mirror on the desk, most likely for the nose. <laughs> My interviewer gets me off guard with his opening gambit. This CV's full of lies and balls and absolute horse shit. I mumble an apology. I guess I ought to leave. Au contraire, the job is yours of Conservative MP. <laughs> <laughs>